Welcome back into Talking Fitchburg out at the Hy-Vee on Whitney Way with my friend Aaron, the best dietitian I know today. Aaron, how's it going? It's going great. How are you? I just pick on you because I like you. I know. And I like what you got <laughs> set up today. We're going to be talking about hitting the road yes. and putting that perfect picnic together. Although I said there's nothing here that was in my recent picnic, maybe the protein, but... Well, maybe we'll learn a little from today. Exactly. I'm always looking for new flavors as you head out. So yes. we've got a lot to talk about, uh, but first and foremost, if you're thinking about putting something together special and it's going to taste good, there's an easy, uh, easy place to start. And what is that? We talk about it all the time. Start with your My Plate. Ding. <laughs> so it's as easy as that. All right, we're done. It's as easy as that. So think about your five food groups, your um, dairy, protein, grains, fruits, and vegetables. So starting with those five food groups, you can make any meal or snack nutritious while on the road, um, whether you're going on a long car ride or a trip to the beach. And you say here, as a general rule, include like three, three to five. So you don't have right. to go all out to fill that plate, exactly. but you're looking at it as a base start. Exactly, and for snacks, so if you're driving, you know, long road trip, having at least, um, I say two to three food groups for a snack is recommended and three to five food groups for a meal. I'm thinking just in my head that I would just have the peanut butter jar and a spoon, but that's a different, uh, different Maybe conversation. I'll snack on a couple carrots with that. Maybe <laughs> some crackers. Yeah, yeah, mix it up. All right. Exactly. Um, all right. So let's talk about uh, proteins on the road. Peanuts and peanut butter is why I transition to that. Easy to come up with some things, and peanut butter goes with anything, really. Exactly. I agree. So with your your nuts, grab a big one for the whole family. That everyone can enjoy. Um, those high peanuts are great. And then also peanut butter. You can easily make some peanut butter sandwiches for the road. They don't necessarily have to be refrigerated at all, so it makes it really easy. And then like you said, if you're going for a full spoonful of parents of Maybe it's celery or carrots or something else you like to pair with peanut butter. I can't believe you referenced me with a spoon <laughs> and trying to make it work. That's awesome, Erin. Uh, uh, also uh, with this, uh, examples of, of some other nuts. So I always look, there's a ton of nut choices. It doesn't really matter, does it, when you're picking out, if you're choosing between the nut family, so to speak, you really can mix in anything, right? You could or do be a, cautious. You could definitely do a variety of nuts. Um, Peanuts specifically are really high in um, those those great fatty acids. So it's it's a plant. It's not coming from meat, right? So this is more of a plant-based fat option. Um, and then they're high in protein. So great option all around. Um, you're also going to get some really good vitamins and minerals as well. There you go. So you have to choose the peanuts. I'm just saying. <laughs> There's a lot of nuts out there, but you got to choose the peanuts as a good option there. Uh, also, trail mixes. Ener these energy things, uh, you say yeah. energy balls. Energy I mean, bites, what are they energy made balls. Yeah, these specifically are our Hy-Vee made ones. So you can buy them right in the store if you don't want to make them yourself. But a lot of energy bites are filled with, again, peanut butter or nut butter of your choice. And some other good things, like you can add protein powder, you can add chocolate chips or M&Ms. Um, you can add dates um, and add some different dried fruits to give it more fiber and help you feel fuller longer. So it's a quick, easy treat, um, but filled with lots of nutrients. It looks really good, like I'm hungry for that right now. <laughs> uh, other choices in that one to three food group, uh, yep. you say trail mix, cheese and crackers, Greek yogurt, yep. uh, cottage cheese, apple slices, all great easy things to pair up with. Yep, and a big fan favorite, the cheese Well, I was saving that, that it gets its own <laughs> talk, but yes, you, yep. cheese is amazing. <clears throat> Definitely. I always pack cheese curds on my car rides. Um, they're such a great protein rich snack. And of course, we're in Wisconsin, so we have to love cheese. Yeah, you, you have to love cheese. <laughs> have to love cheese. No matter what. Okay, <laughs> gotcha. All right, uh, you've got the cooler packed with some cold items. If we're looking to pack some of those cooler items, yep. literally cool, uh, what do you recommend uh, that could be easy to use? Well, first and foremost, um, use water bottles and freeze those to keep your cooler cold. And so, turns into water afterwards. Exactly. Look so then you'll hydrate. Like so um, definitely a win-win there. You don't have to worry about taking uh, um, ice packs that are going to thaw and just go to waste. So freezer water bottles um, and then pack your cooler with some great options um, for the road. So those cool options like your cheese curds, your hummus, 
with some um, veggie sticks, maybe you pack some yogurt, maybe you pack some um, cottage cheese, so you can really do a good variety within your cooler. Yeah, and you just gotta get the right cooler so it stays exactly. cool. Yep. But I mm -hmm. love the cool idea with those water bottles, that's very smart. All right, self, uh, shelf stable items, yes. where would you go? There's a ton of different options. <laughs> I know, you gotta think about that because there are so many there choices There are so here. many choices. I always first start um, with something that's gonna give me some good fiber. So um, some of the Harvest Snaps, those are great. They're loaded with some great fiber and protein. These are gonna be a better option over, let's say, veggie sticks. So How dare you? Very similar, but so much more nutritious. Another great one is gonna be your dried fruit. So the Soli's um, completely 100% fruit and great fiber content in there. It's not bad, I, and this one gives you a crunch too. Like if you're yes. looking for that, replace the chip even, like exactly. it's a good, good crunchy. Nice savory egg. option, yep, so it's awesome. All right, and finally, don't forget the drinks. Don't forget your drinks. Healthy drinks here, folks. Not Wisconsin drinks, healthy drinks. <laughs> so as we talked about the water in your cooler, um, the ice turning into water, you can definitely drink those. Stay hydrated on these hot days in Wisconsin and Been wherever else you're going. Yeah. Yes. My other suggestion is Remedy Kombucha. So this is um, a kombucha that doesn't need to be refrigerated. It's in the can. It has live cultures. It's great for digestion and zero sugar. And how does it taste, like what would you describe the taste to be? So it's one carbonated. So if you're looking for a carbonated option, um, you have that. They're sweet, there's a variety of flavors. And then one actually, they do have a couple um, that are energy based. So if you need that little extra caffeine on the drive, you have that too. Um, but they're sweet and then also a little tangy um, just because you have more of a fermented beverage. And if you're out on the hot days as far as staying hydrated and you're picking your drinks, what would you stay away from? Mm, a lot of caffeine. So That'll caffeine will dehydrate you, same with alcohol. So I know in Wisconsin, tend to drink often. So make sure you're staying hydrated with water. Um, that's gonna be your number one to hydrate and then finding low sugar options. I gotta say, Erin, this is actually really easy to come up with when you're really yes. looking at and I was like, where did you find these things? And it's, it's not hard. It's not hard, scattered throughout the store. All the inside aisles um, will give you some good options as well as our Hy-Vee Health Market. All right, well, if people wanna learn more, uh, you know, or even just get a tour to kind of find this stuff, where can yeah. they go? Go to hyvee.com slash health. You can sign up for tours right on there or even talk to our customer service reps at Hy-Vee and grab my number. And uh, those energy uh, bite things, I mean, we add like 10 part uh, chocolate chips, or are you okay with that? You know, whatever makes you happy. <laughs> <laughs> Within reason. Within and, reason and, and, and moderation. And moderation. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you, Erin, so much for your time. Thank I appreciate you. it. <laughs>